What are you doing? Play Pokemon, of course. Pokemon? That's for four-year-olds. Jeez, grow up. That's right, four-year-olds. I haven't played Pokemon since I started to walk. But Pokemon's the coolest. Have fun with your Pokemon. I'm gonna go do a real manly thing, like chop wood. Hello there. Are you a boy or a girl? I'm a boy. Okay then, tell me your name. So your name is... Tim. Hmm. What is my grandson's name, who also happens to be your rival? Why can't I get past the tree? Why can't I get past the tree? Why can't I get past the tree? Hello? Why can't I get past that tree? If you go into the tall grass without a Pokemon, you're gonna have a bad time. That had nothing to do with my question. Why can't I walk past that tree? If you go into the tall grass without a Pokemon, you're gonna have a bad time. Uh, why can't I walk past that tree? Hello? Hello? Excuse me, sir. Um, uh, sir. Okay, um, why, why can't I get past that tree? Here, had this HM. It's called cut. You use it to cut down trees. Here you go! Wait, weren't you the same guy from before? Hey, remember my Whoa! Did you know it's physically impossible to run without these shoes? Here, take them! Wait, aren't you the same guy from before? Like, both of them? <sighs> Wanna grab my notebook out of my bag, buddy? Um, I think it's under the bike. Well, you can, you can get out of there, right? Whoa! This is a time for that, So, what are you drawing, exactly? It's a dragon, obviously. Yeah, it's clearly a dragon. That's not a dragon. That is a cotton ball with a head and feet. It is, too, a dragon. Just look at it. But, what? I... <laughs> Hello? Hey, remember my super cool 
Rat-a-tat? Why do you keep Why calling me? It's never from regular Rat-a-tat. It's like... We meet again. You, stop right there. What? What are you doing? You cut down a tree without the first two gym badges. That's against the law. But that, that makes no sense. I, I didn't make the rules. I just enforced them. Oh, God. <laughs> Who told you? He did. <gasps> HM didn't tell me that. He shouldn't have to. Everybody who's everybody knows that rule. Let me see your trainer card. What kind of name is Astic? People just randomly started calling me that. Yeah. You don't have to be ashamed of your own name. So you mean to tell me that you don't know about hidden machines and gym badges? And what? Gym what? Are you kidding me? <sighs> okay. Let me put it simple for you. There are certain things you can't do without these hidden machines here. You can't get past a tree without cut here. Don't even think about walking around it because you can't. You're somewhere really dark? Too bad. You need this one. Flash. What about a flashlight? Excuse me? Do you like swimming? Yeah. Why? Well, that sucks because you can't even step foot into water without surf. You need to fly somewhere quickly, Astic. You take a plane. What else would you do? A what? No, you give this to a flying Pokemon and they'll fly you there no matter how small. Okay. And finally, you want to move a rock? Then forget about it. You need strength to move rocks. But what if... No exceptions. Astic. Oh, fine, but what about the gym badges? Do I really have to spell everything out for you? There are eight gyms. The more badges you have, the more HMs you can use. You need the first two badges in this region to use cut. So I suggest you go to the first gym and get a badge there from Brock, the gym leader. Okay, and where is this gym? Pewter City. It's north of here. Now get out of here, and I don't want to see you cutting down any more trees. Astic. But... Uh, fine. I'll leave. you're going. Um, I need to get to Pewter City. No, you're not. Well, why not? Oh my god! Is he okay? He just needs his coffee. Well, why coffee? He's passed out. He just needs his coffee. He's physically incapable of moving without his coffee. Then why don't you go get him some? Are you kidding? I'm not getting it. Well, I'm kind of in a hurry. Oh, no, no, no. You're not getting past here until this man gets his coffee. Well, I can try. <laughs> Coffee. Now. Okay! Here's your stupid coffee. This cost me a fortune. A fortune? How much did you pay? You people really overprice everything. I paid like $300 for this. Wait, you mean Poké Dollars, right? No, I paid with US Dollars. What are Poké Dollars? Oh my god, how stupid are you? Don't you know that Poké Dollars have the same value as Japanese Yen? Wait, what? You could have spent only three US Dollars on this. Well, damn it, give it back then. Too late. Hello, young man. You want to learn how to catch Pokemon, don't you? No, I have to get to Pewter City. Oh, you'll never beat the first Jimmy if you don't learn how to catch Pokemon. Okay, but is your wife okay? <laughs> She's dead. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, so what do I do? You have to weaken it before you can catch it. If it's too strong, the Pokemon, you won't be able to catch it. Okay, um, the Bulbasaur, attack it! Hey, look, it's not moving anymore. It looks like I can catch it now. You it! But what's wrong? It's weakened. I can catch it now. You can't catch a Pokemon after it's weakened. It's likely to help you with this weakened. But shouldn't that make it easier? But I. Oh, okay. Sorry then. Kids these days. You! You're the one that gave me that HM. Here, take this useful item. It's called Repel. Use it to keep away Pokemon. Here you go. How do I know this won't screw me over like Cut did? Oh no. Hey buddy. What are you doing here? I just beat the gym leader. How many badges do you have? Fourteen. But wait, I thought there was only eight badges. Yeah, and I only thought there were 150 Pokemon, but that didn't last very long. So how do you beat the gym leader? This is the rock type gym. Okay. And? Sorry, I gotta go. Whoa! Huh. Rock Pokemon Tim. Oh, tree coffee. That's it. What did I do this time? I saw you move that rock. Let's go. But what no! No! Oh hey, did you uh, win the gym battle?